Hey guys, uh, it's been a long time since I've updated, but uh, yeah, shout out to uh, Guitar Praise forums. Uh, I know I haven't been participating a lot, but um, I just want to let you know that you know things have been good in my end. Um, been a part of uh, worship teams and I don't know, just jang just really jamming along, I guess, just practicing. Um, so sorry, it's a little bit informal. Um, I've you know I decided to just record randomly because. Uh, I've got my acoustic bass here, and you know it's kind of quiet here. In a, I'm actually visiting home right now over the weekend, so I've got you know the free time to, I guess, just make an update. It's been a while, so uh, I don't know. I'll just give you an update, I guess. So, um, what I do have here is a little gift. They're not really a gift, but I guess it's really a prize. I think from Indonesia uh and the trip a long time ago it's uh it's an acoustic bass so uh it's it sounds pretty good i think it's got that little it's got a mellow side but it's also got that bright kind of uh, upper treble that you know many basses look for so here's what i got uh it's a brunswick uh brunswick acoustic bass it's not you know it's not a very you know brand that you're going to be familiar with um it's not an ibanez acoustic or a fender acoustic or whatever you're looking for but uh it's uh it really is you know i think it's a piece of treasure for me uh, it's, I mean, it's not the most expensive thing. I got it for maybe 200, 300 bucks, uh, US, but I mean, I paid in Indonesian uh, rupiah, which is uh, significantly cheaper. Um, I mean, it does, it does sound pretty good in my opinion. Um, you know, again, it's got that kind of deep tone to it, but it's, the, it's got, it can fulfill uh, that cutting tone that many bassists want. You know, hopefully not to get attention. Uh, you don't want, you know, to get, uh, I guess, take too much from, you know, your playing in a, in a worship setting, but. Uh, it does really fulfill that role in a pretty interesting tone that you can't really achieve uh, with an electric bass. I mean, I guess, I guess like I'll play a couple, I guess I'll play a scale. Sorry, hit my uh, <laughs> head of the bass on the table. Um, so let me get, kind of give you a sample. It's E string, A. as opposed to, um, you know, kind of like a uh, sustain that's just really flat from an electric bass. This one's got like a boom to it, like a strong attack that you can't really get. Um, so let me keep playing, I guess. <laughs> So the tone is definitely has a clarity to it. Uh, there's a, it's actually, an, I forgot to tell you, uh, I forgot to mention this earlier, but it's a acoustic electric. So it does have the preamp necessary for, you know, plugins if you want to, you know, direct it out or whatever. Um, this is what it looks like. I mean, you've got presence, bass, treble, but I think what really makes it interesting is uh, how they have the presence knob and that really makes the sound really makes the sound of your bass a lot different you know the higher the presence you know the stronger the attack the more clear it is uh, and the lower the presence it, it sounds more like an electric so I mean if you want kind of like a you know a casual acoustic kind of sound I would raise it more towards a higher presence and and then if I want to fulfill more of an electric role I'll lower the presence but uh, yeah that's really it there's really not much <laughs> I figured I owed you guys an update after, you know, being missing in action for, what, a year or two? But, uh, yeah, I mean, sorry it's not much. At least, you know, I kind of give you guys an insight to what an acoustic bass sounds like uh, from, you know, someone who's been playing electric for years. Um, but, yeah, I do recommend that you do pick one up. I mean, it's not going to – one of the challenges is that it won't be the loudest thing, but it does really fulfill that, you know, the convenience. Um, you know, if you don't want to, you know, lug your electric and you just want to leave an acoustic at home, um, you know, it's great to practice. You don't have to set up an amp, no cables necessary, you know, no worrying about plugging it in. You just literally take it out of the case and play just like as it's, you know, it's an electric, I mean, as an acoustic. So yeah, I mean, no hassles of electric, just, you know, playing acoustic. So it's really great for practice or, you know, if you want to take it to camps, uh, retreats and, you know, if you're just lazy to just plug things in you know, just pull out your acoustic and you're good to play. Um, but yeah, that's all I really have. Um, you know, maybe look forward to more. I'm not sure yet, but, you know, it is an update nonetheless. So, yeah, uh, I guess I'll see you later. God bless.